Lindsay Perry's been obviously choreographing the piece and I've been assisting with that, but I've been able to sit and watch how they interact with her and how they take on tasks and challenges. It's, it's quite nice that she frames the space and she makes loads of patterns and things come out of nowhere just by really simple movement um, and getting the company to work as a company and as a team. Well, that helps because it gets them used to working and, and being with other people rather than being individual dancers, but it also looks amazing. Their choreography isn't something they've had a, a lot of practice at for most of them, and it's been quite interesting that literally from day one we said we want you to find something, we want you to make, you make some material based on it, whether that be a still image with the body or a phrase of movements. And some of them found it quite easy to kind of take an idea and run with that with movement, but that has been a challenge that they've actually got loads and loads better at throughout the week. And I think that throwing them in at the deep end really has made them understand that choreography comes from anywhere you want it to come from, because we said just take the whole of the Harris building as inspiration and it can go anywhere as well. And actually, the majority of the piece has been something that they've created through ideas or stimulus that we've given them rather than them learning material. In terms of contemporary dance, I think... They, they're finding it quite um, strange sometimes when we're asking them to walk or run on the steps or just be in a certain pattern without kicking a leg or doing a spin or any of the traditional dance moves. And I think that's made them understand as well that contemporary can be something that isn't already created or it can be something completely pedestrian that anyone can do, but they've got to do it with some presence and some, some difference in them. All of us have benefited because we've all met each other in different styles, so then we can incorporate that into our own. Working outside has been quite hard, like, different to what I've done before, not working on a stage and sort of not having that safety of, like, wings, so, like, you have to know what you're doing, like, all the time, and also not, like, completely being told what to do, actually, like, having to interpret the choreography, like, in our own sort of way, not just, like, it completely set. Well, I think I've done it since I was two, so I think when I'm happy, I dance, and when I'm sad, I dance. So I think it just helps a lot, and it's just all I do, really. And if I didn't do that, I don't think I'd do anything else. So.